Brazilians love their caipirinha, a perfect drink for the beach. And you know what? I love caipirinha too. I've had a few. It's time to pay my respects to Brazil's most famous hard-hitting cocktail. How strong is a caipirinha? How many can you drink? And what happens when you've had too many? Spoiler, stop drinking before you get too happy. What a f***ing day! Fortaleza Brazil. I kind of felt compelled to make this. You've seen me sipping caipirinha like it's lemonade, but these drinks are strong. I'll show you each step of the ride so you'll know when to stop. Okay, you guys, this might be the most stupid video I've ever done, but you guys have been asking me how strong are the caipirinhas? How many caipirinhas can you drink? What is the ultimate number of caipirinhas to drink? And I'm not just gonna let you sit there and wonder. Today, it's time to find out the truth once and for all. This video is pretty straightforward. We'll spend four hours sipping caipirinha and show you exactly what it's doing with our body and mind. We make this sacrifice so you don't have to. You can thank us later. Hey, what is that? Is that a turtle? Yeah, but it's definitely good. Yeah, it could have started better. Seriously, this is heartbreaking. Oh no. Our best guess, a shark attack. Please, tell me this was a shark and not the work of humans. Just hope it died from natural cause. That seriously killed the mood, but we got a job to do. Let's do it. Let's do it. Round one. Oh, yeah. It is caipirinha time. Oh, no, 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 no. A coco gelado, no. Uma caipirinha limão, por favor. Yes, okay, can you All right, before starting this experiment, Remember, this is conducted under controlled circumstances by experts. Don't try this at home. Here to keep an eye on the experiment, metabolism expert Mason from the US. Bora, how do you think this is gonna end up? Probably good. I think uh, only good has ever come from drinking. Says the expert. <laughs> Caipirinha número um. Mm. Muito bom, caipirinha, muito bom. <laughs> a normal sized caipirinha contains about 9 centiliters cachaça. First sip coming up. Cheers, dude. Enjoy. Ah. <laughs> that was a good first one. And since this is a serious video, we'll be doing it the scientific way. With every caipirinha, I'll be grading in three categories how I'm affected by the drink. We're gonna check my mood, we're gonna check my focus and my ableness to communicate. And simply see how far we can go until I'm not able to function anymore. Cheers. So what's up with this liquor? Cachaça makes you become crazy and do things that you cannot imagine. The other day you know what you can do, what you're able to do. Cachaça makes some euphoria so you can you you feel to dance, to talk to people, to do everything you want to do. I recognize this feeling of euphoria and wanting to speak to people, yes. <laughs> this might not end well guys. This guy is already planning to do a backflip. half a caipirinha in. How are you feeling so far? So far I'm feeling a little uh a little tense, but I'm sure after two caipirinhas I'll be flowing real good. <laughs> <laughs> yes, he will be flowing. Caipirinha has some serious power. So, mood pre-caipirinha. It was a pretty rough day yesterday. Uh, I had to get up early this morning. I feel a little tired. Wouldn't say I'm in a particularly good mood yet, which I have a sense is about to change. Bro, I you know you're from right? Oh, you do? Yeah. Oh, gringo in Brazil? Gringo almost, uh, Swedish gringo. Swedish gringo. <laughs> How many caipirinhas can you drink? Maybe then four is fine, and then I'm done. <laughs> Maybe three or four. Before I could drink more, but today, can three or four. Are you a better dancer after four caipirinhas? Yeah, for sure, man. 
Honestly, people ask how to learn Brazilian dance. Caipirinha is the answer. So, how about you? Which emotions are you feeling right now? Um, I'm feeling good, but I don't know how much of it's just in my head of just having the drink in my hand and how much of it's actually because I'm drinking. Feeling good, what is that? I feel talkative. Let's start the experiment. So, ladies and gentlemen, I thought I was going to be reading a little from my favorite book. Now, I have no idea what this book is about. It's gonna be awesome. All right, here we go. Prologue, 1969. Marsh is not a swamp. Marsh is a space of life where grass grows in water and water flows into the skies. Oh, well, that's how bad I read when I'm totally <laughs> sober. <laughs> let's see how bad it gets. Brother, let's get on with this. Goodbye, Caipirinha. If you're not a serious drinker, expect some clear effects after the very first drink. Okay, after one caipirinha, how is your mood doing? It's actually a very big difference. Just in one caipirinha, I feel much better. I've stopped thinking about the work things, the things that were bugging me just before. I feel a little bit more relaxed. And your communication, I can tell you're getting a little bit more talkative. I am definitely getting more talkative, yes. And how about your focus? Uh, I would say I actually improved my focus just a little. I have a feeling the focus thing is gonna be the one I'm losing fastest. But at the moment, I feel very focused, yeah. Overall, all of those have gotten at least one point. Mood has definitely been topped with the two points. Let's get another. Let's get another. Let's get another. You order shrimp? We don't order shrimp here. I strongly advise to wait at least 30 minutes before ordering a second drink. This is not your regular gin and tonic. That one's way sweeter than the last one. You know you've left the station when you're sitting there with a happy smile. I'm starting to feel my eyes wandering a little bit. Seeing something interesting? Brazil's national drink is simple and genius. It only has three ingredients, local booze cachaça, lime and sugar, topped with ice and love. All right, second caipirinha, halfway in. How are you feeling, buddy? Feeling so good. I'm just happy to be here. You're looking happy. Problem is, the happier you get, the lazier you get. For every sip I take, I get less interested in actually finishing this video. I would say this is about the time you reach the sweet spot. Your mood is great, you feel more open, relaxed, you're still pretty much in control, but you're sensing the slope getting steeper behind you. Look at it, this is happiness. It's gonna get worse and worse from here on out. Just remember, weren't you supposed to supervise me? Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Is this the new gringo look? I don't know. Classic caipirinha effect. Friends wander off, randomly talking to people. Have you traveled anywhere outside of Brazil? Oh yeah, talking to strangers, not a problem at this point. <laughs> Where are you guys going? So, would you say he seems uh, drunk or sober to you? Uh, yeah, I think he has some red cheeks, I can see. <laughs> oh, that's a sign. Let's see just how bad the caipirinha has hit me so far. On the morning of October 30, 1969, the body of Chase Andrews lay in the swamp. Ah, I can still read. All right, my friend, feeling that caipirinha kicking in yet? Feeling good. <laughs> All good. All good. It's time to find a new watering hole and try those legs. I don't feel like I'm having any particular problems walking straight. Talking. I might be. Yeah? Yeah, I got in the water. Probably shouldn't be in water right now. All right. I think the third one will be uh, the deal breaker. No point delaying the inevitable. Eita! <laughs> Number three. <laughs> Funny thing, when you get that strong caipirinha, it probably has the same amount of alcohol as a normal one. Just a little less sugar to cushion the punch. Describe how you're feeling right now. Vibey. 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 You want to dance? I want to dance. <laughs> yeah, classic effect to caipirinhas in. You just can't sit still anymore. You want to dance, socialize, something. Where are we going? I don't know. 
yeah, at this point you'll be a communications expert. Experimentando, cuantos caipirinhas? Cheers, dude. Sal maior. Esse gringo parece bêbado para você? Ela precisa beber mais, né? Cinco, mais cinco. Quantos caipirinhas só pai feito? Eu tomei duas, eu já tô mais ou menos. Duas. Duas. É, duas. Mas acho que tomar até uma cinco, né? Cinco, eu acho que é. Cinco! Ah, é? Não, é cinco. Cinco? Cinco. Opa, e depois cinco caipirinhas, você está sentindo... Super de boa. <risos> Super de boa. Você, você recomenda cinco caipirinhas para ela? Sorry girls, he doesn't have Instagram, but he's got some killer dance moves and a lot of excess energy. Except for the low slow flap of the herons wine lifting from the lagoon. Yeah, I'm missing it. I'm missing a few words there. How do you feel after these three? I feel so good. I can't wait to have two more. Are you scared about putting two more caipirinhas in your body? I'm scared, but I'm excited. <laughs> I'm glad my metabolism expert is... <laughs> yeah, three caipirinhas is usually my recommended hard limit for a day at the beach. Especially in Rio, thieves love drunk gringos, and if you look like this, well, you will be a target. Alright man, how many caipirinhas can you drink? Maybe eight, before we get drunk. But eight. It's a good yeah, eight. It's fine. Uh, you can still perform after eight caipirinha. Yes, I can still, but uh, not not too much. <laughs> Time to bring the rest of the drinking to a safe location where guards look after you. Yes, this is where we're going. I think I was supposed to be the one running the experiment, and now I'm the one that's super drunk. Yeah, he's lost control. Get yourself comfortable. You're gonna get drunk. <laughs> Ah. Yes, a little hangover massage. I don't know what's happening. Amigo, duas caipirinhas, por favor. Caipirinha number four. You're feeling that energy now. <laughs> are you are you in heaven, my friend? I'm in heaven. Caipirinha heaven. Still feeling. How many caipirinhas are the perfect caipirinhas? So, what is the perfect number of caipirinhas? 25, let's go. 25? Yes. Why not? What are the phone? 11, 12, why not? Let's drink. <laughs> okay, she's way ahead of us. We gotta speed up the drinking a little bit if we're gonna manage to get kicked out of here. How many caipirinhas are perfect for you? Like six caipirinhas. Six caipirinha. Yeah. How do you feel after six caipirinha? I'm pretty drunk. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're getting there. And she walked down the sandy lane. Yeah, I've lost it. The stubby nose shoes were fake alligator skin. End of story. The thing is, you will always think you're reading well, uh, but I'm assuming after four caipirinhas, perhaps not. Right. This will help. <laughs> Every caipirinha is my favorite caipirinha. Uh -huh. Can I? Cheers. Cheers. Warning, after you've peaked, it goes just as far downhill. Those superpowers are suddenly gone. No, no, no. You cannot drink it. It's mine. Is there a favorite one? There is not a caipirinha in the world I don't like, but... I'm feeling very relaxed right now. I don't have a care in the world. <laughs> I see it. If you're at a nightclub, this is where you call the Uber home. <laughs> yes, I definitely don't have total focus at the moment. Not walking super straight, no. Yep, there's a prize for everything. Remember all that energy you had from the first Caipirinhas? You'll have to pay that back again. <laughs> oh, you got scared, little buddy. I'm sorry. I startled you. I startled you. You keep sleeping. <laughs> that's, that's why you shouldn't have five Caipirinhas 
And why is Caipirinha so popular here? It's the perfect drink in the whole world. I couldn't agree more. <laughs> How do you feel after? <laughs> ah. I need to be done. I need to be done. Uh, put those glasses on and relax. Yeah, this is such a bad idea, but science demands sacrifice. And without music and dance, you'll just keep falling. One of the few caipirinhas in my life I'm not enjoying. Let's pull the plug on this. No more caipirinha! <laughs> Summary, five and a half caipirinhas in three and a half hours? Not recommended. All right, my friend, how are we feeling? I'm feeling good. <laughs> I'm ready to go home and fall asleep. Which caipirinha was the best? Um, number three. I think I also uh, vote for number three. Uh, last one, totally unnecessary. <laughs> no, no, no caipirinha is unnecessary. But probably would have had a little more energy if we just stopped that. <laughs> three or four. All right, now you know the true price of caipirinha. Please don't let our sacrifice be in vain. If you like this video, be a gentleman. Subscribe and support the channel. Thanks for watching and be safe.